resurrection. No donation, no salvation. And remember, respect is everything. And we're back. So this video was supposed to come out yesterday, but I was running into technical problems because uh, I had to make some changes to the figure that were um, beneficial because the transformation didn't work quite right because uh, I uh, overlooked some details that I probably should have paid more attention to that made the figure untransformable. But anyway, today we have Inferno and Grapple. So I decided uh, I was going to put Inferno with Red Alert because in my story they're kind of a, a pair, but um, I decided for every character I redo I'll include a new character. At least I'll try to, but uh, anyway. Um, so as you can see here, they are both uh, their trucks. Yeah, I couldn't find a maker or model on uh, Inferno's fire truck. Same thing with uh, Grapple's truck since he's literally a recolor, but... Yeah, could not find a maker model. I did about maybe three hours of you know research trying to find a model similar to it, but nothing. So we'll just say they're um, their own thing since he's actually a little different. Uh, Inferno here does have a new weapon. Uh, he has both a water cannon and a flamethrower because not only is he good at putting out fires, he's also good at starting them. So yeah, I just thought that was a cool little blast effect that I would include in there. Just because, I don't know, it, it seems like a good idea. Anyway, let's not waste too much more time, and let's get to the transformation. Alright, so technically Grapple is the new guy here, even though they're both pretty much the same figure. So we'll start with him. So first, we're going to rotate the, uh, the front, uh, I guess, cabin of the truck. Go ahead and fold this out like this. That'll come in useful later. If I can get it to work correctly. There we go. Alright, we'll leave that there for now. And then, pretty much just stand them up. There we go, that's better. Oh, don't mind my jack-o'-lanterns. They're just here for uh, for the, the season. <laughs> anyway, fold his arms out like that. Fold his head up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go, put his hook up like this so he can use it. Um, cause in my story he actually uses his, um, his grappling hook a lot. He has two grappling hooks. He has the one over his head and then he has the one, uh, that like shoots out of his arm since it's supposed to go with the character or something. Just something I made up for my story. I'm going to spread his legs out just a little bit so he looks a little more natural. Apologies if the joints are really loose because, uh, like I said, I'm kind of just working with whatever resources I have available since, uh, I'm trying my best to save money for a new computer because my old one is, she ain't doing so hot. But anyway, let's uh, look at Inferno here. Also, uh, I included a ladder this time, which uh, the water cannon flamethrower thing connects to. Alright, same thing as uh, what's-his-face here. Um, his is a little different. You can actually um, fold these wings up a bit, but otherwise it's more or less the same. Unclip the legs because they clip in differently. Uh, actually, I lied. Uh, you have to rotate the arms out just like this. Uh huh. There we go. Fold his head up and then put his wings up here. So, yeah. Uh, oh, whoa. Those, uh, those came off when they weren't supposed to. Kind of fold that back to get it out of the way. He actually has waist articulation, but that's also because he's built a little differently. Like I said, I, I, I build these mostly out of convenience. I don't really have a specific template that I use. But um, let's go ahead and give him his uh, his cannon of doom. Uh, I should have... I think I made grapple some weapons, but I, I don't remember where I put them. So there's his little water cannon flamethrower combo. Uh, his eyes are a little darker. Again, uh, just kind of working with what I got. But anyway... Um, there's really not much else to say. There is a little more backstory to them. Uh, in fact, a lot of my emergency bots like Prowl, Ratchet, uh, Red Alert, they all have a backstory to them. But I'll get to that in the next video because we got two more LEGO Transformers that I want to look at. But uh, I also try to put stuff in between these videos so that um, just to kind of keep the content a little more varied, some variety, you know. 
So uh, I may do a toy haul after this. Not sure yet. But uh, anyway, uh, until next time, you all have a good one. Hallelujah! Another soul saved!